think I want to be a painting. Oh, better check the time. Almost done. Hey, stop! Time is up! Let me see your artwork! No, no, no! I'm not done yet! I need more time! Alright, let me see what you got. Don't disappoint me. Ah, this is horrible! You're missing the color black! Ah! Oh, no! The paint on the picture was still wet! What did you do to my laptop? Oh, well, I guess it's actually my fault for startling you. Why did you do this to me? The worst! Oh, miss, there's a cloud. <sighs> okay, I think I can fix this. I'll be right back. Okay, I think what will solve this paint problem is more paint. I'll use this pink. I'll just layer the colors. A whole range of colors. Time to introduce straw power. Well, and blowing power, really. Ooh, the colors are spreading. It's looking really cool. Okay, there. I've covered the whole space. It looks great. <clears throat> Miss? What's that now? Here. See? I fixed the paint problem on your computer. Hmm, let me see. Good use of color. Nice placement. Come down here. Hmm, what do you think is going on here? Oh my gosh, what's happening? Oh no! Whoa, how did we get here? Miss, we're in a challenge! I'm pretty excited to be here. I wonder what we'll have to do. Mmm, I didn't know the tea in this place would be so delicious. Look at that over there! Oh, wow, look at how beautiful they all are. So much color. I've never seen anything like it before. Indeed. Look at how they move in the wind. So beautiful. I absolutely love them and their beauty. Hmm, this tea has gone off, I think. Hmm, gonna be sick. Oh, man, come on! We are being so complimentary of them. Oh, my goodness, isn't that unfortunate? Why are you laughing at me? You got pooped on, too. Huh? What are you talking about? Oh, my... Uh, see, I have drank out of this cup. Oh, my goodness, <laughs> this is actually quite funny. Why are you laughing? There were two poops! Wait a second. <laughs> that gives me a good idea. Oh, uh, this white canvas will not work. There we go. This is much better, I think. Okay, I need some chalk. And then I'll draw the number two. Since that was my inspiration. And then I'll need to draw a second two. <laughs> two twos. Then I'll build up from there. Have to make some waves around here. And a straight stick. Gotta put some feathers over here. This will be the wing. Can't forget to draw a cute little eye. And of course, it can't be a bird without a beak. Time for a fun little chalk trick. Blending. Ew, this is so gross. Why did this happen to me? And I'm done with my picture. Ahem, take a look at my artwork. I believe I did an excellent job capturing the parrots. Oh my goodness, I love it. Huh? No! You've got to be kidding me! The garden is just lovely today. Oh, an apple right from the source. Look at all of these lovely fruits just waiting to be gathered. Hey, do you see what I see? She's so cute! It smells so delicious and sweet. Oh my goodness! I can't believe it! Look at this beautiful arrangement! My goodness, these blooms frame a mirror! Oh wow, look at that! She really loves those flowers! I can't believe it! I'll have to take another look! This can't be me, can it? Have I grown younger? <sighs> I was so beautiful back then. Is it a magic mirror, do you think? I don't know. Oh, I just feel completely inspired now. Where's she going? Eh, doesn't matter. I better check my mirror. Hmm, where do I want to start? Oh, are you gonna paint me? Okay, hold on one second. I can do something better, I promise. Oh, yes, that's what I want to do. A stroke here. And over here, too. Yes! Yes, paint me like one of your French girls. Or something. What a wonderful day I'm having. <laughs> yes, you're being the perfect muse, Grandma. Maybe if I try to plump up my skin a bit. <laughs> oh, what is it? What do you want? You're done? Okay. Here you go, Grandma. This is the portrait I did of you. What? Did you not see my reflection in the mirror? Wait a second. You, go away. I need the space. Shoot. 
Okay, Grandma, stay right there. Hmm, I need to take some measurements here. What? What are you doing? Got it. Now I just need to place my fists on the canvas. Now I just need to trace my knuckles here. Great. Now I just need to add on to the shape. This little swirl can trail down like this. I'll continue the pattern over here, too. I'll add the little bow, too. More little hair swirls down here. Time for the eyes. Two of them, of course. All right, next will be the eyebrows. And I'll start on the nose. I'll add some hearts, too. And now it's time for some color. I'll start with yellow. She's gonna be a pretty blonde, just like that mirror reflection. And I think I'll give her blue eyes to go with that blonde hair. The bow can be red. That'll be pretty. I think her lips can match the bow, too. I'll give her some rosy, youthful cheeks. Can't forget about filling in the hearts. Uh-huh. Done. Hey, Grandma, I'm done with your portrait. Okay, listen to me. Take this portrait over to the grandma and show her. This is what she thinks she looks like. Exchange it for the mirror. All right, so take it over there. Go on, head over. Hello, Grandma. Here's another portrait of you. Oh my goodness, thank you so much. Well, you can have it if I can have your mirror. Give up my mirror? Oh, I don't know about that. Oh, I don't know if it's working. I need that mirror. <sighs> okay, fine. I will make that exchange. Hey, I kept the mirror just like you asked. Yes, thank you so much. <gasps> ah, what the heck? Is this what I look like? Do I really have such a piggy looking nose? Ah! I don't want to eat out of the trough. I do like mud wraps. Oh, this field is so nice. Look at the lambs. Come, let's frolic together. Uh, look. Clover. Oh my gosh, you are the cutest lamb I've ever seen! Oh my goodness, it's starting to rain! These raindrops are coins! I feel so inspired by all of this! Ow! What the? Geez, you totally smacked me right in my face! Now I gotta try to get back to sleep. Oh, gotta get rich from the rain. Gonna catch it all, catch the money. <laughs> what the heck is she even doing over there? Wake up! Stop! You're kicking and smacking me! Oh my goodness! I was dreaming! How strange! Wait, I remember being so inspired in that field! I have to make some art! And now I just need a coin, like from the rain in the dream! I've got my marker, so now it's time to start making some art. I've got the coin on the canvas, and now I need to draw around it. I'll add three more in the middle and then connect them. This will be my sheep face. His little nose and mouth are so cute! Now let's add some very cute rosy cheeks. <gasps> so cute! I'm so happy with this artwork! Come on, get back here. I need to auction this artwork. Who would like to bid on this wonderful flock of sheep? Oh yes, I absolutely need that artwork for my office. I will offer $100,000. Oh my wow, that's so much money. Oh yes. Sold to the man in the hat and vest. Ah, none of this art is working at all. It's total absolute garbage. Ah. It doesn't even make sense. This place is so inspirational. Uh, yeah, I don't get it. Indeed. Oh, wait. I think I have an idea about what to do. Paint me. Uh, no. No, thank you. I don't want that. Hmm, I see. Well, you do you then. Huh, I think she's too good to paint my portrait. Whoa, look. A guy just appeared over there. Hello. Yes, I used my magic to appear here. It's nice to meet you. <laughs> wait, I've got something for you. Anakazam. There, see? A treasure chest! <laughs> Are you ready to see what's inside? Ta-da! There's a robot and a doll inside. So cute. There we go. Hello, Mr. Robot. Hello, Dolly. Oh, I feel so inspired by this interaction. The drama. The love. Oh my goodness, they're going to kiss! <gasps> the inspiration is striking. I'll draw a heart across my fingers like this. I'll have to fill it in too, so it looks pretty. Can't forget to color the other side and finger as well. All right, let's use the black and add some dots up here, and smiles, and arms. Aw, so cute. They love each other. They're totally hugging each other and are so happy together. Look. Huh? Oh, they are very cute. That's very nice. Thanks. I felt inspired by the love in the air. Okay, I feel inspired to create my own artwork now. I'll draw a heart using both a pencil and a fine tip marker. And now I need to add little lines at the top and bottom. Next up, shading in with a pencil. I want the shading darker in the middle but lighter on top. Now I'll need to use this ruler to draw a straight line across. 
The lines of the ruler can work as a guide for this knife. I gotta cut along this top line. Now I need to cut up here on the top of the heart. That's one half done, and now for the other side. Okay, now I can slide away this top paper part. Time to add some shading down here, for shadow. It doesn't need to be a lot, just a little will work. I'll bend it a bit together with this blender too, so it's soft. There we go, it's looking so nice and smooth. Look, I'm done with mine now too. It's a pretty little heart, what do you think? No way, it looks 3D. You should definitely show the magic guy. Wait, where did he go? He's totally vanished. <sighs> First he appeared out of nowhere, and now he's disappeared. But it's fine. Meow. Mesmerized, huh? Hmm, well, snap out of it. We have to draw a cat? Okay, I guess. This is tricky. Any day now. Whiskers? I could use a little inspiration. Hmm, is she really asleep? Now I can really get to work. Say goodbye, little kitty. You're coming with me. Hey, Ellie. How'd you get that? So unfair! I want one too! But I can be clever too. Ah, good boy. I prefer the real deal. Aww. Mwah. I've done it again. You're my very best friend. And I'm gonna draw you too. You're bigger than I anticipated. Uh, I can't trace you at all. Maybe if you turn just a bit. This isn't working. What a happy accident! You know how to spell cat! Matt! Hold him for a sec? Where'd you come from? Anyway... Let's do this! <sighs> Much better! Time to turn the word cat into... Something a little more cat-like! I'll make this little guy brown! Don't forget the ears! And perhaps a few fun stripes. Almost as cute as the real thing! <laughs> what do you think? Anybody home over there? What'd I miss? Right, kitties! Cute job, Ellie! That looks awfully familiar, Matt. And now I know why! Sorry! Guess I'm taking this round then. Attention! Ready for today's drawing challenge? Come on, make it something good. A cute little monkey. You're like a giant ape. This is gonna be easy. Monkeys are all about shapes. Looks good so far, but I can do way better. Once your paper's folded, do one more at the bottom. Now draw the top half of your monkey's face. Ears and all. Then form its sweet face. Once you finish his eyes, give him eyebrows and a nose. Then draw the bottom half of the monkey. Whoa, gotta fill in that gap. Those are some scary chompers. This monkey doesn't seem friendly. Now, don't forget to color him in. Keep going. We're almost finished. Now, move on to the next color. Almost done with that mouth. And now for that tongue. Check this monkey out. Not so scary anymore. Hey, cute, right? Great. Don't come too close. <gasps> Oh, I, I wasn't too scared. Whoa, am I seeing things? Or is that a giant gorilla? Uh, Zoe! Oh, you kids! Seriously? Well, that was terrifying. Well, let's see these monkeys. Mine's the cutest. That's good for a beginner. Zoe? Ta-da! Oh. <gasps> oh my 
my goodness. Oh, you win this round, Zoe. Better luck next time, Matt. I have a good rose. And for your very first challenge, we're drawing a goose. Think you can do better? Hey! Wow! I can do that! So cute! Now, where do I begin here? Yes! It's all about the angle of the pen. What you drawing over there? I want to see your technique, okay? Stop covering it! What can I use here? This hand is suddenly very inspiring! And I know just what to use it for! First, trace all around your fingers. The thumb is the head. And the hand is its body. Can't forget the cute little feet. See how color makes all the difference? This goose is a happy yellow. Brown works well for the feet. Almost there! Phew! Okay, let's see him. It's a goose, see? My turn? Well, what do you think? They're both pretty spectacular. This goose sure is making a splash. <laughs> Feels good! Any equestrians in the house? Or at least can you draw some horses? Yeehaw! This is gonna be interesting. I'm suddenly inspired. I've always been more of a unicorn gal. Unicorns are stupid. Get it together, Gina. Now let's get to work, okay? I'm following my own strategy. Just a few folds this way. And then comes the drawing part. Connect both sides with an arch. And keep drawing them until it looks a lot like this. Okay, this ought to be enough. Open sesame! Okay, here's where things really get interesting. Draw this shape exactly like I'm doing. It'll be clear soon. Don't stress. Now we're going into the next section. And do the same on the other side. Very nice. Are things starting to look familiar yet? Yep, it's a unicorn face. But we just have to add a few more features. Loving those gorgeous lashes. Don't worry, all these lines will make sense at the end. Especially when I get going with all the fun colors. It's a unicorn after all. This may take a while, but all these clean single lines make for a smooth streak-free finish. Hey, a patient artist makes for a great artist, I say. Just gotta trust the process. Phew, so now it's done. Time to fill in the most magical part of the unicorn. So the more colors, the better. Nice combo here, don't you think? Last one. It's perfect. Oh, drawing utensils down. Show me what you've got. Okay, here goes nothing. Well done. Huh? Here's mine. Oh my, oh my. You two are talented artists. Oh, you ready for another round? Here we go! Look at it go! Scissors? Now that's a tough one. I'm suddenly inspired. I'll start with some handles. Then onto the blades. Well, that's not right. Now I gotta start over. These things are harder to draw than I thought. Uh, there's just gotta be a way. Maybe I need a new angle. Hey, with these things, you kind of look like an owl. I got it. All I needed was some perspective. These can be the eyes. Now I can draw the rest of the owl. Hard to believe this all came from... A pair of scissors, right? And for the rest of the body, you can draw it freehand. Well, let's add some color. Whether it's orange, 
brown. You can color the owl however you like. Aw, oh, look at those sweet eyes. I can almost hear him say, Whew. Oh, I hope this turns out okay. Ahem. Pencils down. Oh man, it turned out okay. Right? Uh, looks like scissors to me. Yeah? Uh, thank you. I'm next. It's an owl. Well, isn't that magnificent? You win. Creativity is always your best bet. Which of these pieces of art do you want to try? Let us know in the comments. And don't forget to check out our channel for more great videos like this one.